Hello everyone, today I will show you how you can create an instant reload code and this code will reload your guns when you kill a player, like this. It's used in a lot of 1v1 maps, it's a very useful and easy code. So let's go to UFN and I will show you how you can create this system. First of all, we're gonna create a new verse file and I'm gonna call it auto reload device now i just gonna copy the code from our discord server you can find this code for free in our discord server link in bio and i'm just gonna walk you through it quickly you have an elimination manager that will detect whenever a player is killed if a player is killed it will check the weapons the player has by a conditional button and then it will use an item grantor to reload those guns. And there are three options. We have all, hold or none. And um, all will actually reload all the guns you have in your inventory. Hold will reload the gun you are holding. And then none is to actually deactivate the code without removing it from your game the code it's very simple and now we go to our content browser and we need to build the first code then you can simply now you can simply drag the creative device into your world and we need to see here an elimination manager the settings all held and none so i will set this to all at the moment and here you need to add all the weapons you have in your game so if you have 100 weapons you need to add 100 arrays because uh, it will detect which weapon the player has selected and it will reload that specific weapon or that specific inventory but for now we're just gonna add three or yeah let's say two guns we need to add a button for that so a button actually a conditional button two of those item grantor Also to elimination manager like this. So if you have two guns, you only need five devices, but for every gun you need to copy more and more conditional buttons and item granters. We also need to set a gun to this, so let's say we do this gun and we also gonna set the item granters to keep all and we're gonna add the same gun as our first conditional button and for the second conditional button we're gonna choose another gun let's say this one and we also gonna put that gun inside of the item grantor. The only thing we need to do now is to connect all the devices. The elimination manager, conditional button one, item grantor one, and for the second index, we're gonna add the conditional button two and the item grantor two. Now everything is done uh, and like you see it's a very simple system but it's very useful. If you have any questions about the system uh, just send us a DM. Um, yeah so have a nice day. Bye.